question is if a crystal ball could tell you the truth about any one thing about yourself yeah. life the future or anything else what would you want to know and why well I really wouldn't want to know anything to be honest but if I had to pick one would be life I wouldn't want to know about the future because I feel like you wouldn't be able to change it then so what about life would you want to know about life like what's the sense what's the reason why we live so would why would you want to know that well, I don't know, maybe it would open your mind more, maybe you would understand life better if life even makes sense, or if life even has a point. I would want to know one truth about the way the universe works and how I can bend that to my advantage. That's what I would want to know. I already know enough about myself. I've been with me my entire life, so there's nobody that knows more about me than me. What I would definitely want to know is a secret about becoming more successful and how I can apply my experience to anything that's like a law or something that's new or uncovered about the universe that I can grow from. When am I gonna have kids? And why is it taking me this long to have them? I would like to know about death and if I will be able to see my family again. Know how to cope, know how to overcome obstacles. I think that is like a superpower. The most practical answer I thought of in the material satisfactions was to have the winning lottery numbers. I want to know if my family issues are going to resolve itself because I'm a family person and I love people and it's eating me up inside. So I hope I'd ask that if all that's going to fix itself. So I would probably want to know if and when humans make contact with an intelligent alien species. Well, why would you want to know that? Because I love space, and I know that there are aliens that exist. I would want to know what my purpose is and how I can live life to follow it more. Because I feel like a lot of people don't know, and they live life trying to find what to do. I don't know why I'm shaking, I'm nervous. <laughs> But I don't know, I would just want to know like what I'm truly meant to be because I feel like at the end of the day, people might not always figure that out. Tell me the truth, I don't want to know nothing. I don't want to hear nothing about my future. Why? Because uh, I want to create my own future. And as well, uh, life is beautiful because you don't know the future. If I'm going to know the future, what I'm going to do? The future can be bad, the future can be tough and happy as well. Then uh, I want to live exactly how I am right now and uh, just go for it. If I can have five more dogs. <laughs> okay, and why is that? Well, because I'm a dog lover. I have one dog, and because I went now on vacation here in Miami, I bought her lots of toys, and I love dogs, and I want more. I want to know the future of my children. Like, I want to know what they're going to become. Um, if my daughter's going to be a doctor, if my son's going to be an engineer, if my other son's going to like take off with his music career. That's the things that I want to know about. I would want to know if. All the things that I'm planning right now, like for myself, for the future, are worth it or not. Because there's so many days when I'm like, this is too much work. <laughs> like, this is too much work. So, should I continue doing it? Or should I just get a regular do job at a restaurant and just do that? Because I don't want to, like, put all my time and effort into something that won't work out. So, I don't want to waste my young years just struggling for that. I just want to know. I would want to know what we could do about uh, global warming, um, if we can do anything about global warming at this point uh, to save the world. And why would you want to know that? Because uh, I think it's imperative that we uh, make changes, you know, to better the environment and literally save the world. So I just want to know maybe how it's going to be the, the world in two years after this pandemic ends. I would like to know when or how I will be rich and famous. Um, I'd ask the crystal ball if I'm going to be successful. Because that's all I think about all day is if I'm going to be successful. And I'd like to know. So if it says no, I can do something about that. Um, I would like to know if I'm going to be successful. And because it's something that I think about very often that I don't have an answer to. I would like to know how I, I am going to die. So I want to know uh, the reason behind the things that are happening in my life and why they happen in the order they happen because uh, 
there's some things that were before in my past and I hadn't seen them until, until later and I want to know like, why that happened that way. I'd want to know the future, um, what's going to happen to this world. Um, I definitely want to know from the crystal ball how to understand women. Um, for me, it would be, am I on the right path? Because I know that I get super scared of my journey. So I want to know, am I on the right path to create the most and like the biggest impact that I would ever want to create in life? What's the reason there is consciousness in life? Why actually life exists? What's the purpose of it? Whether there is any purpose? I think probably that would be something I would like to know. And why would you want to know that? Well, I think it's uh, just something that pretty much everybody wants to know, like fundamentally, not everybody explicitly asks that, but usually we all are trying to find our place in the world and it all comes from just not understanding why we are here in the first place. One question, it would be where exactly would I be, or where would I be 10 to 20 years from now? And why, why would probably be so that I could know I guess where I'll end up, how I would end up, um, what kind of life I have in the future, uh, what my work would be, stuff like that. I would like to know when the first time would be that I can take my parents and my siblings out for dinner and pay for everything. <laughs> if we're going to live eternity in okay. la eternidad. I would want to know how my life is going to end. I would want to know, why does God call us so early? Or, where do we go when we go to a heaven? Or, you know, what's the afterlife after this? I wouldn't want to know anything, actually. I live my life the way it is, and I'm not uh, anxious to know anything more. I live day by day, and I accept things as they come. And I'm happy like that.